In this video, I'm gonna be taking a look at an email that Amazon Associates have been receiving over the last few weeks. It's this email here, I'll put it up right now. And it's all around changes to the Amazon product API. Basically it's being upgraded from version four to version five. And this email basically says that, yeah, you need to do some stuff in order for your API access to keep working. Now, a number of you have been in touch with me saying you got this email, you're not quite sure what it means, you're not quite sure what you have to do. So I'm gonna be digging into it, I'm gonna be explaining what it means and indeed what you need to do, if anything. Let's go. Hello, it's Alex here, hope you're all well. If you're new here, why not subscribe? Just click that button below. Make sure you click the bell and you'll be notified when I upload new videos and indeed when I go live, which tends to be every single Tuesday. If you like this video, show your support by clicking the like button below. That really does help me out. The Google YouTube algorithm thing just feeds on likes. So feed it those likes and yeah, some good stuff might happen. But anyway, let's talk about this email from Amazon. Let's put it up again and just have a look. So basically this email is talking about the product advertising API and the fact that they're changing it from version four to version five. If you're running a plugin like WooZone or WZone as it's now called, or maybe you're running AAWP or AWP as I call it, for whatever reason, or maybe you've got Amalinks Pro installed and you're using the API on that, then this message may affect you. So the email is made up of two parts, two things that it wants you to do. The first thing is to migrate your keys away from AWS. So let's have a look at that one first. Now my keys have already been migrated. I'm not quite sure when I did this, but they have. So it's very hard for me to show you, but let me just basically break it down that if you're not accessing your keys from within your Amazon Associates dashboard, I'll put it up right now where you'll find them, it's under tools. If your keys aren't in there, then you do need to migrate and you can do that by following the link in the email. If your keys are in there, then you should be fine because they're already in the Amazon Associates dashboard and that's where they need to be and they're no longer on AWS. So that's that bit, pretty straightforward. If they're in the Amazon Associates dashboard, fine. If they're not, then migrate them over. The second part of the email is basically for plugin developers and it basically says you need to make sure that your plugin or your software starts to use the new API version five, otherwise it won't work anymore. Now I've checked with the developers of WooZone, of AAWP and of Amalinx Pro and their software is all up to date and compatible with version five of the API. So that should be all fine. So providing you've got your keys migrated and they're in the Amazon Associates dashboard, and you've got the latest version of those plugins running, which I'm sure you have because you keep your plugins up to date because I've told you that's a good idea, otherwise you might get hacked, then you'll be fine and everything will just carry on working as it was. So yeah, that's it. That kind of brings us to the end of this video. Just make sure your keys are in the right place and make sure your plugins are up to date and you'll be fine, nothing to worry about. So yeah, that's the end. Hope you enjoyed the video. Why not leave me a comment below? I do read all the comments that I get and I will try to reply to as many as I possibly can. If you're not already subscribed, then you can do so by clicking on my face up there somewhere. Why not check out my vlog channel? Click on my other face over there somewhere. And here are a couple more videos they've been chosen specially for you. So I hope you enjoy them. Until next time, bye for now.